Our team coverage continues at Keith Elementary School as New 6's Carolina Cardona takes a closer look at the school's dismissal policy when severe weather strikes. The school district telling us today that this particular elementary school has early dismissal four days a week around 2 p.m. That's when the storm quickly came through and caught school officials off guard. Correct. This storm came upon us fast. Um, as, you may not, or as, you, as you may know, there was no alerts, no severe weather alerts that came and, and prompted, hey, this storm's coming. Um, it was bang, just like that. Uh, a little bit of rain came, lightning, and then it was just pure mayhem after that. Winter Springs police detailing yesterday's deadly lightning strike that came moments after students were being let out of Keith Elementary School in Winter Springs. Shortly after they started those dismissal procedures, they um, recognized the, the situation was deteriorating and so they paused those procedures. Seminole County School District says the remaining students were taken back to a staging area as soon as the storm came through. We didn't have any weather alerts, no notifications, no warnings, no watches, um, and so the school had made a decision to go ahead and begin dismissal procedures. Winter Springs police said Nicole Tedesco and her 10-year-old daughter were near a tree at Trotwood Park, located just behind Keith Elementary School, and were waiting for another child to be released when the lightning strike occurred. Another 18-year-old woman was also injured. So this really caught you guys off guard? Um, yes, I mean, I think this storm kind of caught everyone off guard. It, it caught the National Weather Service off guard. Seminole County School District says all of the schools use weather tracking apps. The school district said yesterday Keith Elementary was using the Climb NOAA weather application at the time of dismissal. The school district says they have more than 10 mental health counselors and social workers on campus to help students and staff during this difficult time. In Winter Springs, I'm Carolina Cardona getting results in News 6. So we put a list together of tips to keep you safe from lightning on our website. Just go to clickorlando.com to learn more.